guys welcome back then i'm in the plantation of fashion fruits here you can see how they are planting the plant we are supporting them with this step of the plant see how they are planting this special fruit so they have some tinderers here that are taking them for the support these are the wire that are supporting them so as we can move up to this place supported by this plant and there are some wires. So this passion has some tinderers. These are the ones that is supporting these plants here so that it can be straight. But it has not produced the sound fruit. As you can see after that it is grown in the farm of the passion fruit. Let's move and show you a passion fruit here. So guys this is the passion fruit as you can see it has produced some fruits and you can see this one here producing some fruits here guys let me show you so that you can see this is the passion fruits here and this one here so that is how they are producing some fruits and that is how the farm looks like so we are moving to the place where they have cultivated and the farm looks so neat so guys this is the overgrown fruit of that passion and this is another one as you can see they are very good man they are very neat and they are very clear so sweet and I wish I would have got one to show you but they are being sold here man. So this is how it is. When you want to get this one in the market you can, you can get it with the 30 shillings, Kenya shillings. In US dollar you can get it with 0.3 US dollars. So that is like a quarter dollar. And this is another food here. This is another one as you can see. So that is how the fashion foods are man. Tell me, do you have these types of fruit in your country? Do you have them? Have you ever seen this one? Just comment in the section here. Section here. We are at the farm where passion fruits have been cultivated. They have approached, they have approached some weeds. So these weeds are kept inside here to act as like manure so that they can, when they rot, they give this plant a manure so that it can grow fast and this is how it is being supported. So you can see the farm is very clear, they have cultivated here, they have approached some roots. And you can see this one, this is the place where they just harvest that water for irrigation and this is the seedbed. This is the seedbed of the passion fruit, this is the manure and you can see that one. So when that uh, seeds have grown, they just approach them and they start planting them in a row. You can see they are very neat. You can walk up to that part when you want to go and uh, cultivate. Okay. So guys, this is the uh, top bahai. It is used to store. This is where the, the bees are kept inside so that they can produce honey. Man. This is how they hang this type of the Kenya top bahai. So when you want to open this one, you remove this part of the top and then there is some part they will do some holes so that those bees can enter inside. And then when you want to harvest this, remove this top part of the box, then you can harvest the honey inside man. But now they want to attack those bees so that they can come and live inside here. Man. You can see that another one there. So guys, this is a local farm showing around how Africa is man, how people do their cultivation and how people keep their crops and livestock man. So, so guys, this is a lemon plant. This is how it is man. So this lemon, so this lemon fruits, and then the fruits are grown. You can see how the plant is here. You can see how it is down there man. It has been, they have no teeth at this part because maybe it has some <coughs> small part where they dated some long time ago. So this is how the plant will do. This plant belongs to your country, guys. As you can see. Tell me in the comment section whether you have seen this type of the lemon plants in your country. I'm in the farm of the tomato plants. Here you can see. These are the tomato plants. These are the fruits. They have grown after. They have been harvested. This is the ripened fruits. And you can see this is the fruit that is 
being produced and it is deepening now. So guys, you can see these plants, they are being supported by this so that they can stand straight so that those fruits cannot rot in the farm. And you can see how the farm of the tomato are. There are some tomatoes here which are very, which are very healthy. You can see it is very, very healthy. You can see how is it, man. It's healthy. And you can see how this plant of the tomato are. <coughs> so these are the tomato plants here. You can see, tell me whether you have some tomato from farm and plantation in your country. You can see up to that part is the farm of the tomato. It is somehow not made, but uh, I think they will cultivate sometimes. So that is how it is, man. This is the farm of the tomato. That is it, man. Guys, this is a banana plant. You can see the banana plant, you can see some banana plantation here, how, how they are, man. They have cultivated this part of the plantation, the plantation is very neat. You can see they are mixed with those local vegetables there, known as Uchita, and there are some purples there. So this is the banana plant, here is too small, it is growing, man, it hasn't produced some banana. So that is how it is, man. You can see how they are very neat and they are very clean. There are some irrigation that is taking place here. Because this is Mombasa, man, there is no plenty of lane, so they must get this farm so that they can get water. So just look on this banana plant, then tell me in the comment section, man, how do you see it? Is there in your country, man? Comment down there, but don't forget to, to like, and if you have not subscribed, guys, just subscribe, man. So guys, you can see plant here. small you can see the purple producing flowers and those flowers are the ones that become food after pollination man. you can see how the purple plant is you can see they have cultivated and they are being irrigated every day because in this Mombasa there is no plant of water maybe plant of land I, see, I mean like and you can see this one in the local village it is very very dark you can see how it is there are some seedlings as I shown you and uh, you can see the leaves are very big, man. It is like kills, but this is known as the local vegetable, man. As you can see it, man. And this is the farm of the cocoa plantation there. You can see those coconut plants, coconut fruits on top of that cocoa plants. You can see the farm, man. This is it, man. Yes, you're in the right place. You want to learn how Africans live every day? Well, keep watching as Your Africa News Reporter gives you the real culture of different countries in Africa.